This collection of specially commissioned illustrations pays homage to a selection of Alexander McQueen's most pivotal designs. Show Studio has established a community of fashion illustrators and artists that work in a variety of mediums to reinterpret garments in new and imaginative guises. For the occasion of the Savage Beauty exhibition at the V&A and the Nick Knight and Alexander McQueen exhibition at Show Studio, each of these artists have created an artwork that operates as an ode to an important McQueen design. Helen Bullock created a diptych that presents the front and back of McQueen's iconic bumpster trousers. Playing with the elongated silhouette imposed by the design, her subject's high collar and long legs exaggerate McQueen's true vision for the trousers, which was to give length and grace with a focus placed on the small of the back. She also captures an early moment of theatre from the autumn winter 1998 Joan show. She paints the final moments of the show where the model cavorts in a glowing blood-red beaded dress within a circle of fire that evokes the gruesome execution of McQueen's historical muse for the season, Joan of Arc. Raina Dahl depicts a pink high-collar dress from spring summer 1997 and makes reference to Nick Knight's editorial for Visionaire where he shot the same garment on model Devon Aoki in a futuristic cyborg fantasy. Joey Madame interpreted McQueen's brown pony skin jacket with impala horns in the shoulders from the It's a Jungle Out There, Autumn Winter 1997 collection. The translucent pink and peach skin tones and the horns protruding from her model's head create a palpable feeling of fashion fusing with flesh. Bex Cassie captures the moment in spring summer 1998 when rain started to pour onto the catwalk, drenching the models and making their predominantly white garments transparent in a photorealist pencil drawing. Looks from Untitled Number 13, McQueen's Spring Summer 1999 collection were drawn by Piet Paris, Jennifer Corker and Ray Nadal. Piet Paris embeds pops of fluorescent colour into the rigid sculptural shapes from the show. Corker presents a delicate rendering of the surreal translucent cage dress in equally sheer fabric. Her subject appears as fashion's Vitruvian figure, with her proportions traced out by the seams of her gown. Finally, Raina Dahl tackles one of McQueen's most memorable moments when, during the finale of the show, Shalom Harlow approached two car manufacturing robots that proceeded to spray her dress with black and yellow paint. Eduardo Mata Ikazi painted an elaborate oil on canvas triptych that pays homage to Alexander McQueen's collaborations with jeweler Sean Lean. It depicts their sculptural silver high collar coil necklace. Charles Jeffrey's work on paper is a frantic depiction of the raw primal energy instilled into Alexander McQueen's Autumn Winter 1998 collection, Eshu. Voss in Spring Summer 2001 was another of McQueen's most compelling shows. Stephen Doherty used pastel to draw the dress worn by Erin O'Connor that was created entirely from clamshells and reportedly was broken into pieces during the show. Belwin Yossi created a metallic mixed-media painting that captures Sean Lean's skin-piercing neckpiece of silver and Tahitian pearls that was worn with a gun-grey underdress of oyster shells and a 19th-century Japanese silkscreen overdress. Also from Voss is a black and red, full-skirted ostrich feather dress depicted by Conrad Rosset. The beading that covers the bodice of the piece is in fact painted medical slides. Rosette's spontaneous washes seamlessly combine the synthetic and natural materials that create the dress. Finally from this season, Kukula applied her baroque style to render an Erte-inspired depiction of McQueen's dramatic feather skirt with the headpiece with swooping birds of prey. For its only a game, spring-summer 2005, McQueen's runway took the guise armoured in a rigid leather dress with horsehair fringing. Lane's subject embodies the tenacity and ferociousness that McQueen hoped would translate to the wearers of his designs. One Eye Girl appears in McQueen's Autumn Winter 2006 collection, The Widows of Culloden, in a cream silk tulle and lace gown with resin antler headpiece.
and Gary Cart depicts the haunting Pepper's ghost of Kate Moss that marked the end of the show. The abundant romanticism of the spring-summer 2007 Saraband collection is present in Fiona Gurley, Valerie Servais, Conrad Rosset and Toby Gidio's work. Rosette captures the brevity of the fresh flowers that we use to decorate one of the key looks in the collection. Josie Hall and Unskilled Workers' artworks portray the narrative implicit in The Girl Who Lived in a Tree, Autumn Winter 2008. Hall depicted the solemn black attire of the deprived girl in the first part of the show, while Unskilled Worker shows the explosion of colour, opulent materials and fine jewellery that she embraces once she finds her prints. The Horn of Plenty Autumn Winter 2009 collection was another of McQueen's most pivotal, featuring dramatic parodies of landmark fashion pieces that satirised Dior's new look to Chanel's Harlequin suits. The collection was staged amongst a set laden with debris from previous shows piled high in black bin bags and littered with strewn broken glass. Velwyn Yossi's undulating mixed media drawing captures McQueen's expertly executed Harlequinade ruffle jacket. Corker's stitched rendering of the slim-fitting wrap-over dress with scarlet lining is set amongst a landscape of fractured glass. An unskilled worker presents a hybrid figure of half-raven and half-human. Her subject is fully immersed in the McQueen psyche and crafted in layer upon layer of paint. John Booth tackled McQueen's final collection, Plato's Atlantis, in a celebratory and brightly coloured collage. The design again predicts a body morphic ideal where man and nature live in a mutually beneficial harmony. Collectively, these works pay tribute to the various facets of McQueen's prolific, craft-driven and conceptual oeuvre, and give a new account of his creations through the eyes of a range of artists.